Hey everybody, what's happening? Mr. T here for another beer review and this time we're going back to the IPAs and we're going to go to a brewery down in San Diego called Council Brewing Company Fade Into Obscurity. Uh, it's a double dry hopped IPA. What does that mean? I have no idea. I just know it's an IPA. And double dry hopped, well the hopping is dry and the dry... I don't really even care to be perfectly honest with you. I just care if it tastes good. And the fact that we can get this San Diego beer up here is very cool. How can you get it? You just go to right there, South Winchester Barbecue down in San Jose. They sponsor this segment. They go down to San Diego, go down to LA, bring some beers back up. So you don't have to go through the trouble of driving all the way down there. Not that you would. I mean, we have enough good beer here in the Bay Area to last you a long, long time. I mean, each brewery up here probably has five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, maybe even more really good beers. But it's cool that someone goes down there, grabs the beer, brings it up here, so you can be exposed to different beers. And that's one of the things I love about South Winchester Barbecue. Yes, it says barbecue and the barbecue is very good. Amazing. But I like the fact they're beer people and they want to expose you to as many good beers as possible, which is super, super cool. So let's go ahead and try this. Dig the can. Fade into obscurity. This is 6.7, so this one's a drinkable IPA. You probably have a few of these if you would like. Oh, it looks like it's going to be a hazy IPA, so kind of a... Now, I think most of the hazy IPAs are what they consider Northeastern IPAs. And I kind of like the Northeastern IPAs. I mean, I like the West Coast IPAs, too. West Coast, a little crisper, a little clearer. Uh, the, the Northeast, uh, a little juicier, probably. And this one has Amarillo and Citra, among others. So let's go ahead and down the hatch here and see what happens. Down the hatch! Hmm, I like that. That, that. To me, that is a barbecue beer, a mow the lawn beer. I mean, I don't mow the lawn, but if I did, it, seemingly this would be a good beer to mow the lawn with. Like, I did enough. You're thinking, of course you don't mow the lawn. Hey, I did enough lawn mowing when I was younger. I was the neighborhood lawnmower when I was a kid. I did five yards every Saturday. Probably should have taken me a half an hour, it took me an hour and a half. I was pathetic, I mean, let's be honest. I just, you know, I'd mow a yard, then somebody'd be shooting hoops, and I'd go, oh, hey, let's go shoot some hoops. Wanna play a game of horse? And then my dad would come out and yell at me, hey, boy, get those yards mowed. Oh, okay, dang, gotta go mow the yard. Then I'd get like one or two more, and then somebody out there throwing a football, I'd go, hey, you wanna play some two on two? Let's, you know, let's, let's say, hey, go deep, go deep. Hey, boy, get those yards. And so, you know, basically it should take me half an hour. It's starting at noon, it took me till about four. <laughs> And then I'd always say, dang, this, this is like a lot of work. And my dad would just shake his head and roll his eyes like, are you kidding me? It's not that much work. You're making it a lot more work than uh, needs to be. So I mowed my, my fair share of yards, no more. But if I did, this would be a very good, this would like, to me, this is a summer type beer. Beer you may take to the uh, beach. Uh, again, you're out there barbecuing. You could have a couple of these at 6.7. It's not going to uh, wreck your day if you have two or three of them. Or if you do happen to be mowing your yard, go ahead and give this one a try. Once again, it is Council Brewing Company. It's Fade Into Obscurity. It's an IPA. Uh, Amarillo and Citra are two of the featured hops. And again, we want to thank our good friends down at South Winchester Barbecue. You go down there, you can have some great barbecue. You can have some beers that are hard to find. If the weather is great, you can go out on the patio. Bring your dog, he can come with you, and then you can have a couple beers, and it'll be a good day had by all. So again, thank you very much to South Winchester Barbecue for sponsoring this fiasco.